do this shit again, man. Yeah. 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 You can laugh at it. I'm giving you permission to do that, okay? Give you permission to do that. What's up over here, y'all? Got a co working over here and all that. Yeah. You look like mixed between white and Italian, so I don't know. Like, you know, the N word is cool with you. You say it all the time. Like, you're fun of black people. You don't give a fuck. What's going on, dude, right here? No, not you, Dave. This guy right here. What's up, man? How you doing? Are you another comic? No. All right, so I can fuck with you. Okay, so, uh,. What's going on, everybody? Let's give it up for all the fathers. Happy Father's Day coming up this Sunday. All right. Isn't that cool? You know, like, I'm not your typical black dude. I know both my fathers. Like, that shit is really Like, I don't know. Like, I don't know what the fuck is going on. Like, on Father's Day, I don't know what to do. But, like, should I give my, should I give my real father something or my stepfather? Like, I got that little discrepancy. I can't even walk in the hood. Like, the dude Tell me, they're like, yo, son, you got two fathers, yo, give one of those up, son. <laughs> but I'm like, yeah, take the step, dad. I need to spend more time with my real father, all right? I done had 24 years with him. What's up, dad? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, he's here, he's here, motherfuckers, he's here. Shit, I don't know what to give my stepdad, like, because I'm living at home. Should I give him just, like, a bill receipt? Like, to show him his shit? Like, I, yeah, yeah, you know, I like, that shit is cool, man. Like that, my mom back there too and her crazy ass. Like, one thing about my mother, man, I don't know if all ladies do this. Like, did you ever use the bathroom and leave the door wide open? Like, you know what I'm saying? Like, like, be real with that shit, ladies. Like, uh huh, right here and back there. Like, did you imagine that? I gotta wake up and I'm smelling green eggs and ass, like, early in the morning. I cut around the corner and she just sat there in the bathroom door open. She's like, good, you gotta give me some toilet tissue out the closet right there. It's like, damn, I can't, I can't be doing that shit all the time. That shit is nasty, man. I'm trying to move the fuck out of my parents' house, man. Yes, I, I do. Like, cause you know, I got a girlfriend that, me and my girlfriend, we've been in a relationship for one year, like over a year. Clap it up for that, you know, that's, that's really cool. Like, it's a mixed relationship, right? See, I'm black and she black as hell. We, <laughs> we, we both work at Radio City, like that's why I, I met her there, looking at her. Like one thing I know with black women when they single, that everything is done, hair, nails, got a nice suit on, got a nice dress on, shoes and all that shit. But like one thing I knew about her, something was different. Like she had no weave, she had a wig on. Like yeah. <laughs> Like, this is how I knew it was a wig, because she had a little string under her neck to keep the wig on. <laughs> <laughs> a little tag at the top said, made in Taiwan. His eye really knew what it was, knew it was a wig. Every time she said that, the hair said it was a wig. It was a no hair. It was a turn around. Oh, my God. And, like, you know what's going on right there? Like, I don't know. Oh, my God. Like, I don't know. What this. And, but see, the crazy thing is, every time we go out, like, I'm like, hey, babe, you want to go out to the movie? She's like, oh, I thought it was Fair Sky today. I didn't know it was Fair Sky. <laughs> <laughs> I ain't even see shit. <laughs> but, man, let's go bike ride in Central Park. She's like, all right. Oh, shit. <laughs> <laughs> oh, man. Yo, I love her, man. I love my girl, man. And she lives to the arts, too. Like, she goes to Brooklyn College. I recently saw her at uh, do a piece for the Vagina Monologues. Y'all know what this is, right? <laughs> That is like the U.S. Senate meeting of pussy. Like, that's all it is. Like, like God, if you ever get a chance to go see the vagina monologue, I guarantee you, after this shit is over, you're going to go in the bathroom and pull out your penis like, look, we need to get our shit together, man. <laughs> you ain't doing shit you bitches doing, all right? You, you, you don't spit that, you don't spit that. That was bad. I don't know why I said that shit. I don't know why I fucking said that shit. 
But like, it's like, my girl, she does shit at like the wrong time. Like, timing is, is like bad. Like outside, I'm out there talking to this nice pretty girl. You know, I'm telling her to come to the comedy show. I'm like, Miss, Miss, you got nice pretty eyes. And out of nowhere, my girlfriend just hugged me on the shoulder. I'm like, ah! I wasn't talking to nobody. She just needed directions. Get shit out of here. Come to the comedy show. Sit in the back. Sit in the corner so she won't know you're there. <laughs> oh, I forgot my shit, but you know. Sex is cool with her. No, sex is great with her. I can I can say that. Mom, Dad, I've been lying to you. I'm not a virgin, okay? Like, they've been, they been believing that shit for like the past 24 years. I'm like, what the fuck? No. Uh, but see, like, with me and her, we got like a little code word for sex. We call it Zumba class. <laughs> like, if we out with like a group of friends and shit, you know, we want to go, like, we like, um, like, we're like, we're like, we're like, we're like, oh, we going to Zumba class. We'll be back tomorrow. <laughs> We come back the next day and all our friends be like, all the boys be like, yo, Rashad, I was that Zumba class. I was like, yo, that was the shit. <laughs> it was a lot of sweat and movement, man. I want to go back. But all the girls in the group, they go and ask her, like, oh, how was that Zumba class? They're like, mm, yeah, it was all right. It lasted about five minutes, you know. Like, oh, okay. <laughs> like, god damn, this shit, this shit hurts, man. But being in a relationship, man, ladies only doing shit without permission, man. Like, uh, okay, who's a couple over here? Uh, no, no, I'm talking about this table right here. Like, oh, oh you two? This ain't no type of threesome freaky deaky shit going on right here. Cause you look like the type, I'm just saying. I don't know, just, just let me know. Like, like, my man, does she ever sit on your lap without permission? Fellas, don't you hate that? When your girl sit on your lap without permission? Cause what's the first thing you gotta do? Take all the shit out your pockets, pins, car keys, loose chains, cell phone, wallet. You gotta move shit out the way so she can sit down. She's like, baby, can I sit on your lap? I'm like, fuck, again? <laughs> Look, this little space right here, sit your fat ass down, all right? Don't sit on my fucking lap, okay? Hate that shit, man. But you can tell when a couple's been in a relationship too long. Like, where well, well, are my couples that's like like five years, ten years plus? Mom and dad, y'all should be the only ones clapping in this motherfucker right now. Y'all should be the only ones clapping in this motherfucker. You know a couple been too long. Answer this. Like, like my mom does this. Anytime my dad calls and she see who's calling, but before she answers, she curses this motherfucker out. Like, you know, I know, I know somebody in this I know somebody that's gonna do that shit. Like the first gift you get in life is your name. 
The first gift you get in life is your name. Now, black parents, I know, like, the name shit is, like, going all over the place. Some motherfuckers get unique and all that, and I don't know, like, what the fuck is going on? Like, my name is Rashad for shit. I was destined to be one of two things. Either a comedian or a cab driver. Like Rashad and Shea. It's not like one of them athlete cab drivers in Times Square, right? You ever seen these motherfuckers? You pull them over, he's the happiest shit to see. Hello, miss how y'all do it today. <laughs> Would you like to go to Brooklyn? Please get to the car. I'll dust up that seat for you. <laughs> Rashad and Shea, I got one of them Arabic names, man. Like, I can go into Delhi and get a sandwich with a free can soda right now. <laughs> Shit, my friends got stupid ass names like Day Day, you know all the ghetto names Day Day, TT, CC, Popcorn, Cinnamon. Like, bitch, I'm hungry right now. Like, what the fuck is going on? Then, 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 then like, the pants get unique with the fucking names. Like, I know two twins, they names is Mo Reefer and My Reefer. <laughs> Yeah, I'm not. 